The top five NFL franchises of the 1970s. Just missing out are the Los Angeles Rams and the Washington Redskins. Number 5. The Minnesota Vikings. The Vikings won 99 games, 43 losses, and had two ties throughout the 1970s with a winning percentage of .694. They would appear in three different Super Bowls, but they would lose all of them. They appeared in the playoffs eight times throughout the 1970s, which is pretty impressive, but they just couldn't win the big game when it counted the most. Number 4. The Oakland Raiders. The Oakland Raiders won 100 games, lost 38 games, and had six ties in the 1970s with a winning percentage of 715. They appeared in one Super Bowl in which they won by beating the Minnesota Vikings in Super Bowl XI. They also appeared in the, play the playoffs seven times throughout the decade. Number 3. The Miami Dolphins. My favorite team. Well, I went around back then to see them in the 70s, unfortunately. They won 104 games, lost 39 games with one tie in the 70s, with a winning percentage of 726. They appeared in three Super Bowls and won two of them, and they had a perfect season in 1972, thus far the only team to do that, to go through an entire season without one loss. They also appeared in the playoffs seven times throughout the 1970s. Number 2. The Dallas Cowboys The Cowboys won 105 games and lost 39 games, with no ties in the 70s, with a winning percentage of 729, which happened to be the highest of any team that decade. They appeared in five Super Bowls, which was also the most of anybody, and they won two of them. They also appeared in the playoffs nine times throughout the entire decade. Number one, the Pittsburgh Steelers. The Pittsburgh Steelers won 99 games, lost 44 games with one tie in the 70s, with a winning percentage of 691. They appeared in four Super Bowls, and they won all four of them, including beating the Dallas Cowboys, which probably put them over them for the number one spot. They also appeared in the playoffs eight times throughout the 1970s. So there you have it, the top five NFL franchises from the 1970s. In a couple of days, I'll be dropping another video with the NFL, the top NFL franchises from the 1980s. So look out for that. Also, in the meantime, like and subscribe, and have a great day.